And this will surprisingly not get you killed. Hey guys, Nick here and welcome to the channel. Back once again talking about fake martial artists and really bad self-defense instructors. Unless you have been living under a rock for the past while, obviously you won't know who Commander Dale Brown is. So if you don't know, Dusty Dale Brown is the combination of a young revolver ocelot's hand gestures, the rock's eyebrow, and the make-believe fighting ability of Steven Seagal. Cause now, I will snatch every motherfucker birthday. His self-defense techniques are really bad, <laughs> and most likely won't work. Actually, they won't work at all. No, 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 no! That being said, it won't get you killed. A bit of a controversial statement, I know. And the reason I say that is for a couple of reasons. Reason one, and this is the big one, is that there's a myth that, you know, these bad self-defense videos or classes will get somebody killed. Well, it's because one, these instances are actually very rare. Unless, you know, you are a complete idiot. And reason two, you need to attend his classes and then actively look to get yourself into these situations to try out these techniques, which most likely won't happen. And majority who attend these classes, they'll attend for a short while and then just end up leaving anywhere because, you know, they, with this sort of thing, they will always be a failure to commit. So only like a very small group of people will remain. So while editing this video, I came across Icy Mike's videos, one on Dusty and the other one explaining the biggest myth uh, about the misconception of self-defense. Um, I'll put those links down in the description below so you can check it out for yourself. But um, very insightful and I wish I came across them before making this video. Because now I just look like a copycat. Truth is, if you're living in the United States, you're more likely to, you know, die from falling and whacking the back of your head than, you know, somebody attacking you. Four years, man has faced one common enemy. For years, this enemy has spread menace. This enemy has claimed many lives over the decades. That enemy is the ground. Learn how to defend yourself. Learn the techniques that you need to take your life back. Become the ultimate ground fighter. And then also, if somebody was doing these classes, learning these techniques, and then they get into a situation, right? Then it literally depends on the fight or flight response. And I can guarantee you now, most people will probably just freeze up and do what they're told. But that does not mean what he's teaching is not irresponsible. It totally is irresponsible. None of those gun disarms will work. And if somebody actually attempts that in a real live scenario, they'll most likely get shot. Can't have that excuse, oh, but these violent criminals will not expect it or whatever, or they'll have only a certain amount of time to react and you'll be quicker uh, than they can shoot you or whatever he says. Thing is, a violent criminal has obviously done this sort of thing before and they probably have been met up with resistance. Like, bitch, I got a gun. And you know, if I'm pointing it at, at you and you're trying to do something to take the gun out of my hand, I can step back. None of these things are absolute. It's all situational, right? So, I mean, if a, a scenario like this happens and there's just one thing that you don't recognize, your body's gonna freeze up and you're not gonna be confident to actually attempt this maneuver. 
But with his new status of being a living meme and his given popularity, we're going to have to see now uh, what the future brings. I don't think we've had a self-defense instructor at this level of fame that many people recognize and has this sort of reach and we don't know what that will entail. And we've never had a self-defense instructor get this far, so only the future will tell if this will actually get somebody killed. So this is just my opinion on the matter, um, but once again I can be wrong. But what are your opinions on old Dusty Dale? Please let me know down in the comment section below. And if you enjoyed this video, please slap the like and subscribe buttons and get this cult going. We are still in pre-cult status and I want to get those numbers up. And just that little bit of effort from you can help me long time. Until next time, look after yourselves, take care. Please do not try good old Dusty's maneuvers on uh, unsuspecting criminals. And of course, have a great rest of your day.